Hey guys, it's Not a Mercenary, and today I'm going to do something sort of out of the box. I'm going to create a cloudy, magical, mystical kind of eye look today. So if you're interested, keep on watching. All right, so I already did my eyebrows and my face. For my face, I used this Derma Blend Professional Leg and Body Makeup. This is in the color Fair Ivory 10. N. And I also used this e.l.f. hydrating face primer as well as the AOA perfect finishing pressed powder Also, um for my eyebrows. This one looks really bad. Don't look at it. I don't like it I used the AOA studio sculpting brow pencil in the color caramel. Okay, so let's just get into this eye look I have never attempted this before but I had just got this new face candy face candy palette in the mail and it looks so freaking beautiful it's like a dupe for the one of the Kylie palettes she probably came out with it like a couple months ago and I know just because like I remember these colors but these are really really cute so I really wanted to make a eye look with them and I also got these random cute little pressed glitters and like this one I don't know if you can tell but it has like stars in it so I'm really excited so we're gonna put that all over the lid it's gonna look really awesome so I'm just going to take this fluffy blending brush and I'm going to dip into this light purple color. I'm going to use that as a transition. It's like plastic over the mirror. And now I'm going to go into this blue color from the Face Candy Atlantis palette and it is called Abyss. And I'm taking that on this like pointed brush and I'm going to go inside of my crease. I'm going to take the same fluffy brush and I think I want to go into this color called get down that's this purple color right there and I'm going to take it lightly like this just get it like this I'm gonna try to tap the excess off and try to control it so that it goes more where that transition color went And then I'm going to take this clean fluffy brush. It is the AOA Studio High Definition Brush E103. And I'm just gonna buff it out a little bit. Just so you know, um, I haven't practiced this before. I probably should have, but I'm just trying to go on the fly and just trying to I make something cute because I knew that I wanted to do something with those pressed glitters that I got, but yeah, I'm just kind of winging it. It looks pretty cute, so I'm not mad, you know? For me though, that's kind of like every makeup look. Like, I'll get an idea, unless I'm doing a tutorial of something that I know I'm doing, like um, the Kiki's delivery service. Like, I knew what I was gonna do because I was just copying the cartoon character, but like stuff like this where I make it up, I don't know what I'm doing. Just gonna take that brush from earlier and sort of soften it out. And uh, this doesn't have much, this doesn't have any product on it. I just kind of wiped it off on my pants. I kind of want to add a little bit of like pink to the party, but like, I don't know if I want to do like a, hold on, let me think. I'm going to go into this pink right here from the... This is a dupe for like a Morphe palette. This is the She Makeup 35 Color Eyeshadow Palette that all of these palettes that I have, I got from shophush.com. And they're all like dupes of um, popular palettes, stuff like that. And I don't really recommend this She palette because it's not very pigmented, but it's a little something, you know? And I'm 
going to go back into that blue again. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you, this is just the e.l.f. eye crease brush. Okay, and since I want a little more pink, I'm barely going to try to dip into this color called Flirt from the Aphrodite palette. <sighs> Alright, and then I'm going to go in with this E124 brush by AOA Studio. And I'm going to go into this color called Ripples. It's sort of similar to this one, but this one looks a little more gray or like it's it's like a darker tone, but it's still like going to take a little bit more of that color called abyss on the tip of this brush and I'm going to try and deepen up a line yeah I think I want to make a line right here and then like make it look a little more purple right there and then sort of blend this out okay don't worry don't worry it looks a little crazy I'm gonna take that brush that we had that pink color on and I'm just gonna like Fade it out a little bit. Yikes! That was kind of bad. Hold on. Okay, wait. Just wait a second. Then I'm going to take that pink Miami that we were dealing with earlier. Put that, um, I guess like, um, hold on. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Went, sorry, I just went into this color called Flirt again, that pink color. Um, I'm just kind of like patting it lightly. Okay, that took a really dramatic turn really fast. So I'm just going to buff it out a little bit. Kind of dabbing it. What the heck? Like it looks okay in the mirror and then I look in the camera and it looks really bad. Well, I'm just gonna ignore it and then move on to this eye. We're gonna fix this eye up a little bit. I feel like a kawaii drag queen, you know? Like that's how I'm getting the vibes right now. So what I always do when my eyes get out of control and they're like going out too far, clean this brush off on my shirt real quick. And I'm going to dip into a white, okay? We're going to dip into this white. And then I'm going to like pat around this area because it has way too much going on. I'm sort of like erasing it a little bit. This eyebrow, oh my gosh. Did you see that? Don't look at it. Hold on. What can... I need to fix this eyebrow first. Let's my best. This is ugly. <laughs> Where were we? Right. We were erasing this eye from existence. Just going to take this clean, fluffy blending brush that I got from Wish. Oh my gosh, you guys. My, like, card information got, like, stolen or something. And I had to get a whole new card. And then, like... Two days later, my mom tells me that my stepdad ordered something from Wish and then like got like weird transactions on his little bank statement and he was all like, oh, don't buy from Wish anymore. Like they steal your credit card information. I don't know if he just had bad luck and that happened to him or like if Wish ac like accidentally wasn't like secure enough and that happened. I don't know. So I'm gonna go in with my finger and I'm going to go on my lid first and I'm going to use this white as a base for the next color I'm going to put on it. Okay, and now I'm going to go in with Abyss, but like very lightly. I'm gonna take it on my middle finger like this and I'm just going to pat it on my lid. So before we go into the glitter, I'm still not happy with this eye. It just, it looks really patchy and I'm mad about it. 
I'm gonna go in with this little pink shade up here again and load it up on this e.l.f. eye crease brush. I feel like it's the shape of my eye for some reason. If um, you think that my shirt and my wig is ugly, it's okay, like I do too. Why I'm being dumb and using my fingers, I'm gonna use this brush again. This AOA Studio E124. Anyway, guys, I think I might actually have like a sponsor pretty soon or something. Cause these people on Instagram, they commented on my picture and they were like, hey, if you wanna be a promoter of our products, DM us. And that sounds kind of shady, but like I did, you know, I DM'd them. I'm desperate, you know? So I was like, hey, what do I gotta do? And they were like, tell people to use your code. It'll be your Instagram name. And we will activate your code. And then three people use your code, then we'll start sending you items so that you can like advertise their products. And they have some really cute stuff. Like they have some kawaii stuff, but then they have some like kind of like like thought stuff you know what i mean like they also have um like k-pop stuff like k-pop merch like bts merch and they have wigs too so i might it's almost like wish where they have like a bunch of stuff that like seems reasonably priced all right i think i'm going to do the bottom lid and then we're gonna move on to the glitter and i'm really excited and nervous about it i think i'm going to be brave and use this color called kingpin just because it's so pretty and i really want to use it but it is a little dark, so we'll see how that goes. Put like a little bit of that color kingpin in my crease as well. Now I'm gonna clean off this AOA Studio 124 brush. I'm going to make a little smiley eye moment. If I mess this part up, which I don't see how I could, but if I do, I'm going to lose it. So today I'm going to be using this NYX Glitter Primer. It looks so cool, huh? Like the holographic. This AOA Studio E124 brush, it just looks like that. I'm going to smooth it out on my hand. And I am going to pat this all over my lid but very gently because I don't want to smear that blue and make it all patchy. You know? Okay, it's already starting to get tacky. Now I'm going to take this. Ew, I'm scared. Okay. Oh no, it's in my eyelash. Okay. All right. I've never used this before, but I saw it online and I thought it was so cute. As you can tell, there's like little stars on it. It's really hard to like, it's like a sand texture. I don't know if I like it though. I I have nothing against these sparkles. They're so freaking cool. I feel like I'm just not good at applying them. I don't know. I definitely do want to fix my under eyes because I feel like they could be cute. I'm just being dumb. Oh, I just spilled my whole makeup bag. This wig kind of sucks, like no joke. There's not like combs in it or anything. Oh, and it keeps falling. Okay. I'm just gonna take this NYX Photogenic Primer in the color 00CW. I'm going to take this damp beauty blender. Well, it's, it's actually just a beauty sponge from shopmissa.com. I got it for a dollar. It was really, really good. Everything from Shop Miss A is a dollar. And most products I use are from Shop Miss A. I'm going to try to do my little smiley eye moment again. I'm going to use this AOA Studio E116 brush. I'm going to start with this color, I think. Yeah, I think that looks a lot better. I 
think now I'll move on to some eyeliner. I'm going to take this color called Heartbreak from the Aphrodite palette. It's just a regular black color on that brush and I'll just like wipe it off on my pants. It is the AOA Studio E116 brush and I'm just going to lengthen my eyes. I'm going to take this Amuse Cosmetics Pro Big Lash Mascara. And I use this all the time on my channel because I'm not a big mascara connoisseur and I just got this from Shop Miss A for a dollar and it works fine. I use fake lashes anyway, so a mascara isn't really all that important to me. Okay, so I am going to put the most mascara towards the outside to lengthen my eye and then put a little bit on the inside like that. And I will do fake lashes for this look, but for now, I am going to move on to the lips. Actually, let's put on some highlight first. I'm going to go in with this Sephora Golden Hour Highlighter in the color 01 Dust. Alright guys, we're finally to the end, so thank you so much for watching, and this is the final look.